Okay, this is our test video. We need to track that person's face with the magnetic effect. So right click on the video and choose Story Maker. And then under, under Decorate, there's various options. Uh, we're going to use the mosaic effect, which is to the right. Choose it and then hit Close. Okay, then you'll see the magnetic, or the, the effect appears on track number six. So right click on track six and choose attach to position and then it explains how to do that but you can then adjust the size and the position of your magnetic effect so we put it over the person's face you can also make it a little bit bigger if you want and then we need to tell the program what to track you need to choose something with high contrast and when you're ready click click on continue and then just draw a little box around the area that you want it to track. So you see that's tracking his face. It's doing quite well up to now. And then he wants to turn. And now you can see it's it's caught something else there, that that little bit of shining in the window there. But that's not a problem, just let it carry on until it's finished. And then you'll see if we play it, it's perfect up to there and then it loses it. But that's not a problem. Just stop it. Go back slightly with the arrow keys to the last place where it's correct. And then put a cut using the T key. Just cut the video at that point. And so you'll have everything fine to the left. And now we need to just readjust the right. And the way you do that is right click on the effect. Choose attach again. And then just click continue and click continue again. Just choose any arbitrary position, let it run, hit escape, and that just resets it. And now you can do it properly. So just right click, choose attach, adjust, and then just adjust the position, the size again if you need to. Then click OK, continue, and now choose a new position for your tracking object. And if you see it's not tracking it nicely, then you can just hit the escape key to start again. And then you can select a new box. Here we see it's tracking it quite nicely, so we just let it track it. And then again, press play, you'll see it's, it's following his face starting to lose it so we just go back to where it's got it nicely then again you can split the clip at this point and then again just reset it by saying attach continue continue choose an arbitrary position let it run escape it and then do it properly so adjust it again put it on his face click OK Continue and choose your new box. And just continue to do that until the end of the movie and you'll have his face then tracked and covered the whole way.